Thank you. What is this? We, uh, we submitted uh, two episodes. One involved some uh, location shooting on, on the beach with Carly and uh, Drew. And then we also uh, submitted a, an episode where Holly appeared to burst into flames as she emerged from a, a uh, jerry-rigged cabin. Yeah. So it was, it was quite a challenging time. We had a lot of fun. Yeah. Thank you so much. Well, if we, I, 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 don't re, I cannot clearly say, but I believe this is our fourth in a year. I mean, our fourth year in a row. Fourth year in a row, yeah. You know what? Port Charles takes place in a parallel alternate universe where you can freeze the world. You can get from, uh, you know, uh, Port Charles to Venezuela in, in, in a, between a commercial act, yeah. And people's memories can be stored on a flash drive. So, so what has happened to the Earth to put those, uh, you know, uh, large cliffs up in Florida is quite different, yeah. Congratulations on a golden year. What's this golden anniversary mean to you and the team as we celebrate another year or two? We... We, we are on ABC and we're enorm enormously grateful to be on ABC. General Hospital has been through so many uh, reinventions over the years. We um, owe a tremendous legacy to Gloria Monti and to Wendy Rich and of course to Frank Valentini who has brought us into the 21st century. And we're living our 60th anniversary. We're now into our 61st year. We have our writers back. There's gonna be great stories to tell. It, General Hospital continually reinvents itself and the wonderful thing about directing on General Hospital is it's a new genre every day. We tell action adventure, we tell romance, we tell stories that unfold at a pace that no other uh, genre unfolds and we get deeply into characters and it allows for performances that the audience really can um, savor. And uh, I'd see it only getting better uh, in the coming years. So. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much.